Hello and welcome to A VO's Journey. My name is Anthony Pika. This show is all about helping the new and upcoming voice of our artist grow their business, sidestep all the crazy things that I seem to step on. I have a really great episode for you today. I'm going to show you how I quickly and efficiently make a an audio sample, uh, a demo spot, if you will, that... I can use to market my business, whether it's putting it up on a website, posting it on social media with a link to like my email address or my website. But I go through the process on my uh, through my DAW of recording something, finding audio and putting it together, mixing it and then uh, finishing the file and letting you listen. So I hope you enjoy this. Please remember to like and subscribe below. And also don't forget for more information like this and stuff, you know, we have what's called the VO's Journey Elite Academy. We're running a special right now. First month gets 50% off. We do six classes a week. Today's Monday. So we've got Susan with our voice acting. We do marketing. We do processing audio like this. Plus I do all kinds of different videos and things uh, as well as challenges, audio books, DAW work, marketing, all that jazz. Check it out. There'll be a link below uh, for the special. But other than that, enjoy. All right. Bye-bye. It would be a cool thing if I came on and showed you something that I do that I think will be very helpful um, in creating. If you're just trying to start to add music or mix your own um, uh, work, instead of paying lots of money for a demo, I wanted to kind of share with you a couple of quick things that you can do. Uh, I'm on Adobe Audition, okay? And basically uh, what you're seeing right here is actually my podcast from today. I just did episode uh, 39 and 239, excuse me. And what I did is I always start out, so you, you know, you can do this for a podcast, but you'd also do this for your demos, right? Is I basically start out with um, a just a raw file, right? A file that I record and, you know, I record here. So hello and welcome to a VO's journey pod. All right. So you, like, you can hear like that's the that's the opening to the podcast. So basically what I do is, you know, I record a raw file. So when you're trying to start and let's say you're just trying to create a demo or a sample all right so let's say you're going to come in here and you know you're going to create a sample so i'm going to go to audio i'm going to create tests right to start a new file all right and basically all i'm going to do is i'm just going to come in here and now for me because i'm on my microphone in my editing studio, I'm just going to switch my microphone over. A lot of you will not have to worry about this. Your mic is already tested. I'm just going to, hello, testing, testing. So what I'm going to do is we're going to do just a, I'm going to improv something um, that we can, we can make into a sample. Okay. Uh, how about um, Diet Pepsi? Because <laughs> I have a Diet Pepsi in front of me. Um, and how about we make the Diet Pepsi uh, something like uh, upbeat. It's nice outside the summer. Um, and I want uh, to, dis I don't know, describe how uh, crisp and refreshing Diet Pepsi is during a hot summer day. All right. All right. So that's just, just, just as an easy sample. I don't know. I'm just going to, I'm going to improv this. All right. Um, when you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. It's pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. I'm hot. And my kids won't leave me alone. But you know what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Maybe your kids will leave you alone. <laughs> that's probably the silliest uh the silliest sample ever in the world uh so what <laughs> what i do i gotta i gotta stuff in here when you're outside sun is hot beating down i <laughs> just look like, this is this is silly so for the sake of this all right um uh i've gone ahead and uh created a just an improv file what i'm gonna do because this is 28 seconds long so i'm probably going to start to come in here and just reduce in between here a lot of the extra uh, space, okay? So that I can go ahead and make this a lot shorter, right? Because I want my samples to be between 8 to 12 seconds. Can they be more? Absolutely, they can be more. But, you know, for this sake, I'm just going to try to make it shorter, 
All right, uh, we'll see how short I get it. I'm not gonna go too far with it. All right, here we go. So I've, I've reduced the time there. Um, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and I have what I call an effects rag, okay? And basically it is something that I've had for a long time that I continue to use to this day, even in my new space, cause it works perfectly. Uh, I use a mouth to click, voice to noise, uh, dynamics processing and a hard limiter. All right. And, you know, I just go ahead and apply this. All right. And it will take care of any issues that I have Took care of some, you know, any of the issues of there was any noise. Um, now, just real quick, you might be wondering, I have a uh, an Apollo twin and on my Apollo twin, all right, I have a digital console um, and basically on the digital console here, Okay, uh, this is my um, 416, which is in my booth, and this is my uh, RE20. All right, now here, if I open this up, this is a free insert that goes with mine. You can see um, the uh, the uh, uh, compression. So this is compression that's going on right now while I'm talking to you. And this is EQ, different settings that are geared to my voice, all right, that are coming through and it's pre, it's doing this pre okay so this is a digital insert uh, think of it the same way as we would a analog insert like a dbx 286 okay that's an analog it's the same thing it's an insert but because the apollo twin is a digital interface okay then it allows me to do it digitally where i can buy inserts and things i can buy plugins i don't have to have hardware which would be the dbx 286 okay um, but anyway, so that recorded through that. And you know what I just realized? I realized that I used the wrong effects rack, right? Because I used the effects rack for my uh, 416 and not my um, RE20. So I'm just going to do it again. And there we go. All right. So now I'm going to raise the overall volume some. Probably come in here, lower it. Now, you might be asking me a question like, hey, Anthony, what, you're doing all this stuff. Why? How do you know what to do and everything? So here's the thing. I've been doing this a long time, and I know that with my voice and everything, I know that I want this to be shorter. So I've, I've you know, nailed it down, and I know that with the style in which I just did it, this will probably work well. So let's take a listen. When you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. It's pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. So I'm actually gonna... Pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. I'm hot. And my kids won't leave me alone. So you can tell like it's pretty choppy in some of these places. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just come in here. And, and under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. It's pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. I'm hot. And my kids won't leave me alone. But you know what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Maybe your kids will leave you alone. <laughs> So again, that's just that's just crazy. So I'm gonna leave this as a test raw file, okay? And I'm just gonna say this uh, to downloads as a wave file. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come in here and do a multi-track session, okay? Um, test full. I'm just saying that because uh, I just recorded that. I'm gonna put it on desktop. All right. So now I have my multi-track. So this is where I can do. So I'm gonna take what I just did. Okay, my raw file, and I'm going to drag it in here. All right, so this is my raw file. Now what I want to do is I want to come in here, and I want to go to I use Storyblocks. I'm looking for music. Okay, I use Storyblocks. Uh, I pay for a monthly subscription. But anyways, in the Storyblocks, I'm going to type in, like, something fun. Here's a little tip when you're searching for music. I like to search for music by descriptive words as opposed to titles of songs and stuff. Let's listen. No, I don't like that. I love that. <laughs> I just think it, I love the the beat and everything. So what I'm gonna do is I just downloaded that, pull it over. All right, here we go. All right, I'm gonna come in here. I'm just splitting this to make it shorter. All right, but I like to keep that. I'm gonna. This is a fade in and out. All right, this yellow line is also the volume. Now, I like to start out loud and get a little bit softer as we go, right? So that you can actually hear what I'm saying. So let's take a, just an initial listen here. When you're outside, 
Sun is hot, beating down. Sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. Pretty nice. Okay, so that sounded pretty good. What I want to do is I'm going to come in here. I'm going to go to multiband compressor, and I'm going to use Pop Master. This is a compression uh, uh, already built in. This is a preset that's already built into Adobe Audition, which gives me my voice a lot more pop. When you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah. So, and I can also come in here and do some fun things too, like uh, kids at beach. Let's see what it comes up with. Actually, I like this because uh, we got some ambiance underneath. So I'm just going to take that. I'm going to make sure that, oops, oh, I don't need that because I can always stretch it out. I'm going to make sure that I fade in here and that this is going to be down some. Let's take a look. When you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. Pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. I'm hot. And my kids won't leave me alone. But you know what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing duck. So I would say uh, open a can of soda. Let's see if that actually brings up anything. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's try this one. I don't know. All right, we're going to do it. open a can of soda. Uh, here we go. Let's see. Crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Ah, oh, no, no, that's not very good. Let's see. No. There you go. That's a good one. Usually it's always like, you know, pouring something in there. <laughs> All right. So let's see. We're going to come here. Uh... Oh, what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Maybe your kids will leave you a all right, and then I would raise the Maybe your kids will leave you alone. I still want kids laughing, right? Let's try kids laughing. So I'm just going through here to see what... Let's see. We'll use this. All right, and we'll get some kids laughing here. So let's put it down here. All right, so as you can see, I'm kind of just playing around with this. this is a volume. This is a manual volume. You can actually do the volume over here too. All right, so let's take a listen here and see what happens. When you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach. Pretty nice. But you know what? It's hot. I'm hot. And my kids won't leave me alone. But you know what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Maybe your kids will leave you alone. <laughs> I like that, right? That's actually pretty decent. So I'm going to come in here. Now that I've got this, I actually like the way it sounds. I'm going to go entire session. I'm going to save it to a downloads. I'm going to save it as an MP3. Okay. Um, I could save it, you know, because uh, I think I recorded it in... Something I could save it in 48, um, and I did record it in 24, I believe, I think. So there we go. So I just said that. I just saved that. Uh, let's see where over here it's at. It was test full, right? So here we go. All right, so here's the file. I'm going to raise the volume just a little bit. Anyways, go ahead. Uh, this is This is, I just brought it up. This is just a hard limiter. I like to make sure it's limited at negative one. You can also boost it as well, but I don't do that. I do that instead of normalize. I don't like to normalize anymore because normalizing usually doesn't, it doesn't um, do what you want it to do. It will just raise the whole thing just to the highest peak, then it stops. All right, let's take a listen. When you're outside, sun is hot, beating down, sand under your feet. Yeah, I'm at the beach, pretty nice. But you know what, it's hot, I'm hot, and my kids won't leave me alone. But you know what gets me through the day? A crisp, refreshing Diet Pepsi. Try it. Maybe your kids will leave you alone. <laughs> your kids will leave you alone. That, uh, that's just crazy. Okay, so anyways, uh, and I'm just going to say that. And so now I've got a file that is a sample that I have made. And I just wanted to share with this 
for you today so that you could kind of use this video as a template to go back and see how I look at things and how I do them and I get through them quickly. Remember, when it goes back to finding the music and everything, it's really key to just realizing that you are telling a story. All right. And if some, you know, you picture yourself in that situation. Like I was picturing myself at a beach. What would it be like? What do I hear? What do I see? What do I smell? That kind of stuff. And, you know, tell the story. Okay. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Leave your comments below. And uh, I hope this helps out. Bye bye.